It's the dog here, K Dog from Red Real Films. I know you guys are seeing a whole different um, setup and stuff. I I totally get it. It looks more. I in, in your eyes, it looks more like a vloggy style. But um, don't be alarmed. I'm on I'm on vacation, and when I'm on vacation and I watch a film, um, from time to time there will be. Like, anyways, getting into the review of Windfall. That's right, I just saw Windfall. Oh my god, I'll say this about Windfall. Two th Before we get into the whole thing with Windfall, if you're into these types of films, you'll enjoy it. If you're not, you will be bored out of your mind. This type of film, you have to be into it to really like it. You can't just say, oh, because it's Jason Segel, um, um, Jesse Plemons, Lily Collins, you know, big stars, big, no, no, you have to be into these style. So I would recommend, if you haven't watched it and you're thinking about it, but you're not sure, I recommend you go read the synopsis, go watch the trailer, and then give yourself a decision from there. But if you're for sure know this is your style of film, go right ahead, go into it. And if you haven't seen it, um, spoiler alerts will be in effect here. Potential. If you, so, go watch a film, come back, and if you just want my review, well, you've been warned. Anyway, so, I like the film. It's my type of film. I do like these types of films, so, I, I thought, why not? Um, the film, practically, is, you know, man goes into billionaire's house, lives in billionaire's house, finds out billionaire is a piece of shit, then ro tries to rob billionaire, you know, I know stories like that have been done to death, but in this type of way, oh, it's this was completely different and unique in its way. And I praise the writers and the director for the direction that they went. Praise them very well. The film, it's kind of slow paced. I'll give it that. It's slow paced, but it works for it. For the story and the way they were going for the film and the art style and everything. It works. Certain films, slow pace doesn't work. Like a perfect example is The Irishman. Does not work slow pace, but it was slow pace. This film, Windfall, perfect. If it was normal pace, it would throw the film off. So it needed to be slow pace, in my opinion. You might think otherwise. You might agree, disagree, but I think it, 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 it needed to be slow pace. And it was pretty dark. It, it's not dark in the sense of horror or thriller. It's in the sense of dark drama. Like, like take a take a drama, but turn it more dark, a twisted story in a way, without any thriller or horror elements, essentially. And if you're into dark dramas, you'll like it. Jason Segel, whew, he proved to me, and probably proved to the millions that have watched this film that. He's not just a one-trick pony and not just good at comedies. He could do other things. Like, he could play drama. He could play a twisted person. And, man, looking at Jason Segel, the character he molded for this film felt very, very Edgar Allan Poe-esque. Very Edgar Allan Poe-esque. And I, myself, am a fan of Edgar Allan Poe's work. So if you're also a fan of Edgar Allan Poe, you will enjoy the direction Jason Segel took his character. Woo. And if you're not into Edgar Allan Poe style, well, you're going to be like... You're going to be iffy on Jason Segel. Um, Jesse Plemons, perfect role. Perfect job. He played his role well. Now, what, what, what can I really say about him? His role was generic, but he played it well and made you believe he was him. Right? And then Lily Collins, woo! She really, really pulled out all the stops. I would say one of, not the, her best film, but one of her best roles. Yeah. And and you know Lily Collins, a new and up-and-coming actress in the, in the big stardom scene, right? This proved that she can really go. Like, from beginning, she was one character, and then she becomes another character, and then, boom, twist. Woo! Just like that, a big twist. And you're like... Oh, okay, you know, great job, great job from Lily Collins, perfect. After seeing 
windfall I, and seeing the way Lily Collins perform give her more roles. I really want to see what she could do with it. She should take her ball that she got with this and run with it far because I believe she could be a big star. She could be in the A-list tier. She should break away from indie star and become A-lister like for instance, take a look at uh, Kristen Stewart when she did Spencer. Everybody raved about how she could move away from indie. She could move away from chick flick. Same goes for Lily Collins. After playing in Windfall, she could move away from indie and become a big star actress. That's my opinion. You might have another opinion, but I believe this was her breakout role. But is it Oscar worthy? No, no, no. Not by, by a mile, but based on her previous work this was her breakout role my opinion though and the film the dark tones the dark stories really added and i mean i'm gonna say this a twist at the end some of you might see it coming some of you might not but it was a good twist because i mean the way the film was going you're like if it continues in that same way you'll be like how an uneventful ending. The twist was needed to make the ending more. Give that little oomph, that little thing it needed to nudge it up. You know, give it that little nudge up. And I even like the one extra character they threw in. Because this film only was three characters. Which then they throw in an extra character just out of the blue. And I like the way they did it. How they just naturally introduced him in a way that he felt like he was a character that belonged there like you know like a recurring character in a way but and even though the story was about these three very well done very very well and the way they got rid of said characters so that they could go back and focus on the th main three characters was beautifully masterfully done so that you don't feel like, oh, well, whoa, 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 why? Why bring him in? Why take him out? Instead, he felt like, perfect. He belonged there, and he, and the way he left, perfect moment for him to leave the store. Yeah. Overall, I liked it. I give this three and a half Edgar Allan Poe's out of five. What do you think of it? If you've seen this movie, let me know because this movie does have a lot of mixed reviews. I know. I've checked out through uh, Rotten Tomato, Metacritic, IMDb, Letterboxd. There's a lot of mixed reviews. So I'd like to hear what you think about Windfall. Did you like it? Did you not like it? If you haven't seen it and you think this review is going to make you want to see it, go watch it then. Let me know what you think. Anyways. Remember, smash that thumbs up button, hit that subscribe button, and hit the bell button to be notified when we upload videos. Anyways, remember, keep watching them film.